Hello Shape Explorers and welcome to today's video. Now today we are going to dive in to the world of 2D and 3D shapes. But shh, don't tell anyone because we might have so much fun that we shape shift ourselves. <laughs> now you might be wondering, what's the deal with 2D and 3D shapes? Hmm. Let's take a look, shall we? So first up, we have our awesome 2D shapes. Now these are the heroes of Flatland. Now, can you guess what this shape is? That's right, it's a square. And this one in particular is a flat square. Now it's a bit like a perfect little window or a picture frame, yeah. Now, we can tell that this shape is a square because it has four equal sides and four right angles. That's the corners in this instance. Yeah, fascinating. Now hold on to your hats everybody because now we're going to take a look at a 3D shape. So, we had our square before, but now we have a cube. This is a 3D square and is known as a cube. Now, the difference between a 2D and a 3D shape is that one is flat, but the other has an extra dimension. And that's where the 3 in 3D comes from. And that extra dimension, other than length and height, which are the length and the height of a shape, we have an extra dimension and that is depth. And that is what makes something 3D. Wow. Now, because this is now a 3D square or a cube as it's known, this now has eight different corners and six different faces. You may have already noticed that this 3D square or cube looks like a dice or a box. And that is because anything that is 3D or has three dimensions has space inside it. That's the easiest way to remember if something is 2D, flat or 3D has space inside. Why don't you have a look around where you are and see if you can see things that are 2D and 3D. I've got a couple of examples of 3D shapes just here. Here we have another really cool cube. And this is purple and orange, just like my hat and t-shirt. Yeah, and I made this one earlier today. And here we have a really interesting 3D shape. Look at this. So it's a circle on the bottom and then it has all of this space inside. So it's almost like the shape of a bowl or if you turn it the other way, a bit like a hat. There we go. And that is another example of a 3D shape because it has space contained within it. I really hope you learned something today about the difference between a 2D and a 3D shape and see if you can try and find many different examples of 2D and 3D shapes where you are. And if you like this video, do like and subscribe and we'll bring more fun content like this your way. Take care everybody and stay curious. I'll see you again soon.